Hi, hello, namaste, my dear students. Welcome to AIMS Dare to Success YouTube channel. Today we are discussing about pair of straight lines, homogenizing method related VIP. Very important previous question. Fi find the angle between the lines joining the origin to the points of intersection of the curve. X square plus 2xy plus y square plus 2x plus 2y minus 5 is equal to 0 and the line 3x minus y plus 1 is equal to 0. So it is related to homogenizing method. So the given line is 3x minus y plus 1 is equal to 0. 1 should be positive. I mean constant should be positive. So 3x coming into this side minus 3x minus y coming into this side plus y. So 1 is y minus 3x. Now we are using homogenizing concept homogenizing means x square x y y square terms same as it is x term into one y term into one constant term into one whole square so that is given curve related to homogenizing apply homogenizing we get x square plus 2xy plus y square plus 2x into 1 plus 2y into 1 minus 5 into 1 whole square equal to 0 1 is equal to y minus 3x you can substitute we get x square plus 2xy plus y square plus 2x into 1 value min y minus 3x plus 2y into 1 value y minus 3x minus 5 into 1 value y minus 3x whole square is equal to 0 so next we can simplify my dear students power first coefficient first means power a first so x square plus 2xy plus y square plus 2x multiply inside we get 2xy plus into minus minus 2 3 here 6 x into x x square plus 2y into y 2y square plus into minus minus 2 3 here 6 xy after that minus 5 will be same this is look like a minus b whole square a minus b whole square formula a square plus b square minus 2ab so y square plus 3x whole square means 3 3 is 9 x square minus 2ab 2 into 3 6xy so a minus b whole square formula you can apply later minus 5 multiply inside we get uh, x square terms y square terms x y terms you can take uh, at a time my dear students so now i am taking x square minus 6 x square at a time like that x y terms so first of all x square plus 2 x y plus y square plus 2 x y minus 6 x square you will write as it is plus 2 y square minus 6 x y minus 5 multiply inside we get minus 5 y square minus 5 nines are 45 x square minus into minus plus 5 6 are 30 x y is equals to 0 now i am taking x square terms at a time so we are having three terms that is x square minus 6 x square minus 45 x square now we can take uh, x y terms at a time so 2xy plus 2xy minus 6xy plus 30xy 2xy plus 2xy minus 6xy plus 30xy right in one bracket later y square terms the remaining three terms are there plus y square plus 2y square minus 5y square is equals to 0 so 1 minus 6 minus 45 means uh, 1 minus 51 i think uh, minus 50 x square chota number minus bada number negative symbol take reverse 51 minus 1 is 50 so minus 50 x square 2 plus 2 4 4 plus 30 34 minus 16 is a 28 x y or 30 plus 2 32 plus 2 34 minus 6 34 minus 6 is 28 next 1 plus 2 3 3 minus 5 is minus 2 y square equal to 0 divided by minus 2 so divided by minus 2 we get uh, 25 x square minus 2 14 is 28 so minus 14 x y minus 2 went outside the remaining value is plus y square is equal to 0 divided by minus 2 means minus 50 by minus 2 is 25 28 by minus 2 is minus 14 minus 2 by minus 2 is 1 so 25x square minus 14xy plus y square equal to 0 is look like ax square plus 2hxy plus by square is equals to 0 so a is equals to 25 2h is equals to minus 14 b is equals to 1 so next we can find the angle 
a 2h b values you can substitute in the formula we can write angle formula cos theta is equals to mod a plus b by root over a minus b whole square plus 4h square 4h square can be written as 2h totally whole square why because we are having 2h value so a value is 25 plus b value is 1 divided by root over a minus b 25 minus 1 whole square plus 2h value is minus 14 whole square so 25 plus 1 is 26 so numerator value cos theta is equal to numerator value mod 26 by root over 25 minus 1 is 24 whole square plus minus cup power even number it becomes plus that is 14 14 jar so 14 whole square so next step more 26 is 26 only root over divided by root over 24 24 is 576 plus 14 14 is 196 so 196 plus 576 value 26 by root over 6 plus 6 12 2 right here 1 keep in mind 1 plus 9 10 10 plus 7 is 17 7 right here keep in 1 your mind so 1 plus 1 2 2 plus 5 is 7 root 772 so if you wanted to simplify you can uh, simplify otherwise you can write as it is so cos theta is equal to 26 by root 772 so cos going to right side we get theta is equal to cos inverse of 26 by root 772 so otherwise uh, if you simplify you will get cos inverse of 213 are cancel 26 divided by so that is 193 i hope you understand my dear students please subscribe our channel support with us share to your friends